be proud, bro. Yeah, man. Rest in peace, my father. You know what I mean? Nah, rest in peace, time. Uh, but, yeah, he, he always used to tell me. He always used to be like, yo, you see this guy, Jay-Z? You're going to be better than him. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And I would always be like, I have formation from your dad.
my parents were supportive, but my mother was really more supportive than my, my dad at first because my dad was like, no, nah, you need to go to school. Yeah. You know, and my mom was like, if your dad is saying that, then this was, this what you have to do. But I was just like, you know, stubborn and I was, I was dedicated to this dream that I had. So I was like, yo, nah, I don't see myself doing that. I see myself getting a record deal, just like my big brother, all of that, you know what I mean? Mm. But eventually, I mean, I started, you know, doing little shows around in the neighborhood, local shows. Next thing you know, I'm on TV, I'm on shiz news. I thought it was crazy back then. Yeah. I was told if your dreams don't scare you, they're not dreams. Yeah. So I put everything that scared me and I did it. And I was like, oh shit. So now I just have to add like some, some outrageous. That's why I say I'm gonna be a billionaire before 35. That sounds crazy. Yeah. If I did all this shit, definitely. 35 30, dog. I said 30. So me and Nasty, I guess we cool mm. at this point. Do you think you guys will ever collaborate? Well, he said that he will never make a song with me. Unless...
Vegas, that's why I go to Vegas. Now as you see, they reach, same show, East London, same plane, same flight, you know, we land, pulls up on, like yo.
treat a nigga in a different way. I can only imagine how it's gonna be.
I've acted in certain situations. I took from the experiences, you know.